What's going on everyone? This is Liam Caddison here and today we are going to be reacting to the, the, <laughs> to the ninth episode of Ages of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 4. This is Broken Promises which is going to be the start of the next phase of Season 4 I guess. I'm using phase rather than uh, arc because it's Marvel of course so why not? But yes, it's the second part of this um, Season 4 arc it seems with the LMDs after it was established that Ada went full dark killing Nathanson and basically replacing May with the LMD and keeping um, May kind of locked up. So it's going to be interesting how long it will be until S.H.I.E.L.D. notices that. I have no idea, but it's going to spell for some interesting things for uh, Season 4 and I can't wait to see how the LMD arc is constructed there because it, it start, it kind of, it, I had a feeling that there was going to be some kind of shit going down with Ada or LMDs or anything like that because they were teased heavily in the end of season 3 of course so this is their moment, this is their time to shine and uh, considering we've just finished the first arc in a sense because the Darkhold will still probably have some influence considering that has affected her but I'm so hyped to be starting uh, the second arc I think I can I guess I can say I mean the split kind of um, indicates it, but um, without further ado, it's episode 9, I'm so excited for Broken Promises, let's go. Because we can't have two maze again. Secret. Until your substitute has served her purpose. Uh... So unfortunately. This is sinister. Ada, why? Transferred the dark hole to an agent who specializes in making items like this disappear. How's he going to manage that? Some sort of magic spell? Is this... Right, yeah, probably had your fill of dark arts jokes. What with the flame-headed demon and all of that. <laughs> what we're handling is Doctor Strange. Doctor Red. Oh no, this is ter no, no, this is Terminator vibes. I don't like this. Ooh. Oh, hey, I Luke. Like feeling pain. I so I fixed that. Did whatever you're doing. I was your shield. <laughs> this is betrayal. Oh no. Fits. Ada, what? Uh, I don't like this side from you, Ada. Just. Oh, sh that's morbid. Yeah. If it hadn't been for that Shield scientist, wait, does that mean Shield's back? Yes. Unfortunately, yes. <laughs> you have to fill a bit on the loop. It's like waking from a coma. Well, like, oh wait, what happened? Shield is one of the main reasons the world has the problems it does. There you go. Says, says the anti-humanist who's it's aligned with like the watchdogs. The world safe. I'm not making a case for the whole <laughs> organization. No, no, just the. How about we go for a walk? Stretch our legs. Oh That's no! Center to no! Be transporting the target. <laughs> no. See, I was talking about Ada and bringing and uh, putting her in the field like a dog. This is basically the same thing. Any Let's go for a walk. Day. The watchdogs are about. Big dumb idiot for building that thing in the first place. <laughs> Let's save that debate well, for another yeah. time. Yeah. Right now we need to find Ada, and the first step. I was going to say what she wants. Yes, they might not have known about how it could have affected her, but it's a computer she program, which, which can create some kind of virus in her head that can, yeah, turn her. If it's a, something about it's infinite knowledge, then. It's very easy to co to corrupt it to turn rogue. Be sizable campaign funds to a senator who's willing to speak right now. <laughs> God, Wait, right here. Yes. Let's see what I can do. <laughs> Good luck, Love Jen the American. Much tougher than I'd originally given her credit for. Oh yeah. Well, she's yeah, come through a change. Do that to you. This I think uh, yeah. has been kidnapped like three times since I've known her. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Well, only twice on this planet. Ah <laughs> yes, because of the. <laughs> it's like, it's like yeah. traitor. It was up to the other to do the right thing. And this is the. I don't think VJ would go this length. You're just a cold-hearted bitch. I'm not bitch. an inhuman. Well, I'm your brother. Whatever came out of that cocoon, it's no brother of mine. What a Look bitch! Thank you. He's gonna, isn't he? As much as it hates her because she hates it humans, so brother, it's family at the end of the day. It'd be too hard to find your beautiful, weird science sex bot. <laughs> That's unfair, Mac. 
I've never had sex with Ada. We're just good friends. <laughs> good to know. Yeah. So it is basically yeah. a walking smartphone, right? If a person loses their phone, they can track it. Why can't we do the same with her? Yeah, well, normally we can. Only Ada somehow managed to take control of her entire operating system. Exactly, and she's... a tracking program. Meaning Ada can read her GPS history? Yep. That's not good. That's bad. Yeah, how bad? Once you got into the base, so... I was afraid you'd say that. Uh, she's not gonna take no for... Oh no! She's in the system. Fitz, any bright ideas? Uh, Simmons and I... This is Ultron! Uh, ...non-internet server to power the base in case... This is Ultron all which over again! Seems to happen all the bloody time, doesn't it? At least once a year. Go. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh! <gasps> My hand does that too. No, that's not good. You're not getting that book. Yes, I am. Oh. The deactivation. Oh, no. But I'm going to need your help. No. Oh. No. Because murder us. Because... I know what he's trying. I, need more I know what he's trying to do, he's but human. Then why sometimes you got to put old yellow. I'm making a show lot of analogies here, but like for. You. But sometimes you got to put her down if she no is that hostile, which she is. This isn't Radcliffe. Watch all the Terminator movies. <laughs> oh, the shots! I mean, I know it was but Genesis. <laughs> Oh no. Are you hearing this? She's programmed to quit. Oh no. She did not just go on maximum overdrive. On yep. She <laughs> did. Oh shit. And this is why you need to put Ada down, unfortunately. Yeah, she's. No, it's just the two of us. Mm hmm. Because she was looking through the. Unless she's got a hit of mic. How many times have we been locked up together? I'll keep that in mind. Surely, surely Phil's got a hunch. I mean, he did with Agent 33, but she did not have every info of May Nail down. This does. we came from. But surely in some... Why there? Uh-oh. Because that's where you hit the dark hold. And yes, I was going to say... Which is why we cloaked the book. It was actually Mace's idea. Ada's like, thank you! Great. Blabber mouth Phil. I always worried that robots would try and kill me one day. <laughs> really? Oh! Oh! Has he got super reflexes? Yeah, he, he's got super reflexes. Spidey sense. <laughs> oh. Is he gonna you dodge? Know, regret is not part of your programming. But the Darkhold gave her that. The Darkhold fixed that. It showed me regret Damn that. This and is, desire this for is so many scary. astonishing things. It made you dangerous. Exactly. I only wanted to help you. Well... What the hell? Roll credits. <laughs> that... He had that cooked up. <laughs> Holy shit! I trusted you. Now trust me. Oh, she's got. Cause, yes, she's she's Please, trying to reverse to that. Now. The sympathy uh, speech that he gave. She's trying to use that on him. But come on, don't trust her. She was gonna put you down. BJ, don't do this. BJ, you're making a mistake. She was actually He's going to kill that. you, Gemma. BJ had a choice and he made it. Like what you said about your I'm shield sorry. comrades. Sit! You fucking co This is why you don't. Is that understood? Go to hell. Go to hell. I hope that shield helicopter. Isn't going away. We need to strike back. I can assemble a team. That won't be necessary. I think it's the time to serious and dogs. Hmm. 
least now we know who our real enemy is. Yeah, well, what's going to happen then with the LMD? Because no she's still, because May's still there. Oh, a second is everything cut. Okay, doctor? Oh, no. It will be. It's just. Oh, we were so close. She had it in her hand, Ada, in her hand. Wait. She just Radcliffe, died. why? But she failed. Uh, through no fault of her own. She played her part to perfection. Right down Radcliffe. to my little speech about how the dark hole was making her a real girl. Oscar worthy stuff. Oh, so you so son of a bitch. She was quiet down in the dumps afterwards. You traitorous I protect myself. Shh. Switch to the long game. Will there be another opportunity to acquire the dark hold? Oh. After today. Over this agent may. Oh, you are. But it's for good cause. No, it is a you you sake. Why? I hate him. I hate him now. I need to adjust her proper. And call for. Oh, he's going through a second. Ooh, I'm sure he said that the the pterogenesis phase wasn't complete. So maybe the second uh, pterogenesis is like uh, booting to the full genesis, the full cycle, and whatnot. But um, wow, uh, you can get retribution on the deer now because uh, after she she basically went at two on you. It, it's time for some retribution, isn't it? So, and she deserves it because she is. She, I think this episode highlighted why, you know, she is despised. We've we've obviously pointed out about how much of a bitch she was earlier in season four, but this episode gave a great glance with her line, but of course with the Watchdogs more exploited, and how she not only how she backstabbed his, uh, her own brother, but she used what you know, made her, like, compassionate, like, from her brother when he gave that speech. He, you, she used that to basically, um, sway her brother to, uh, rather than him going to Gemma, so, yeah, sneaky, treacher treacherous, manipulative, it's just, god damn. So, hopefully she'll get a come up and soon, but we'll just wait and see. I mean, now that he's gone through another pterogenesis, I would. I would. I mean, that would be me, but I don't know how VJ would react, uh, but we'll just wait and see now that he's gone through this. That was an awesome start to the second... Uh, oh, I knocked down my battle. No. That was an awesome start to the second act of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 4 with the whole LMD stuff. Ada 2.0 and Radcliffe's turn. Oh. I didn't, I didn't expect him to turn. But here we are, and now we've got... I, I don't like the fact that we've now got evil Radcliffe in the mix. And I'm not sure if that was due to the Dark Hold as well, because uh, we know it can, like, turn people. And it's... it's. I'm not sure if it, it did with Episode 8 when they were trying to bring back Phil Fitz and Robbie, uh, when they were all surrounded with May and Ada, but... Um, or if this is completely natural, but... Um, either way... I don't like the fact that we're going to get evil Radcliffe. <laughs> but it, it was an interesting twist and a nice way to start off the whole LMD arc. Um, Ada won. I don't know why. I do feel like this is, I don't know, better written and de uh, developed rather, uh, to Age of Ultron, should I say. Um, I, di I mean, I, I didn't mind Age of Ultron. I really enjoyed it. But I feel like they've got this, like sorted and whatnot. Yes, they can construct this through different episodes and that, but I don't know. This episode alone just makes me, like, appreciate it a lot more than Age of Ultron, so... But, Ada 1.0, I guess we can call her, was terrifying and it was just really, really interesting to see, especially when Max just went all fatality on her and sliced off her head. It was really great stuff. And then he comes out with that line, he surely had it stored, like, ready to you roll, roll credits. Awesome stuff, but um, it'll be interesting to see where this goes for Radcliffe now that he is basically the enemy with Ada 2.0 in the frame. He orchestrated all of this, uh, the maid kidnapping, and 
God damn it, Radcliffe. I liked you. Now I have to hate you. Hmm. Uh, it seems like uh, May LMD thinks she's real as well. I'm not sure if that's the case, but it seemed, it seemed like throughout this episode she portrayed a sense that she thought she was the real thing. So, uh, maybe that's the case. And I did say that... Surely Fuller might have a hunch that this main might not be exactly who she may be. Because it all goes back to Agent 33, remember when they had that discussion. But then again, Agent 33 didn't get her facts nailed down, whereas Ellen D. May is basically the, a carbon copy. So uh, it might not be as easy to detect that there is something amiss about uh, Ellen D. May, but uh, we'll just wait and see. But... Yeah, it's going to be interesting how they're going to cap this off. The Watchdog stuff with um, Nadia, like I said, it was really uh, greatly constructed and showcased how you, much you wanted to hate Nadia with her manipulative actions to her brother, especially with, like I said, that speech that she that basically echoed to what VJ um, said early on when he was using compassion. She was using compassion too to pull him away from Gemma. Uh, even though we all thought, we all knew that following Gemma was the best option, and it turned out to be that way after she uh, shot him in the helicopter. But it was a really great story. I just enjoyed it so much, and I can't wait to see how Agents of Shield takes this further. I'm really, I really enjoyed this first episode of the new arc, and things are going to get a bit more juicier. But uh, it was a great start, great stuff. I'm just re really enjoying Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 4 at the minute, and I can't wait to see how things go with Ada 2.0, with evil Radcliffe. Oh, Radcliffe, why did you have to join the dark side? But, um, no, awesome stuff, and I can't wait to see what happens further on. So, I will see you guys next time. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. You can check my videos on the right if you want to check out more of my content. You can also subscribe to my media feeds and channel if you want to. I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. I hope you guys take care, and I will see you guys next time. Toodles!